It is news that has shocked and saddened many. In fact, the late senator's father, Mze Ajuang Nyakwamba, Nyakwamba, sorry, suffered shock on the news of his son's death, leading to his admission in hospital. And now this comes as Homabe County was thrust into mourning as villagers thronged Kajuang's home in Waondo village. Here's Fred Omulo bringing us that story. <laughs> It wasn't supposed to happen like this. Not to Senator Kajuang, a man so full of life he probably had two hearts, one full of exemplary leadership and another full of humor. That was the dominant conversation in every nook and cranny across Homer Bay County. The homestead where the senator connected with his native roots came to a standstill, many too shocked to even shed a tear. By his side to the very end was the senator's brother Moses, who maintained a stoic dignity amidst the grief, having been sent home from Nairobi to deliver the woeful news. We still can't believe that he's gone. Just last weekend, he was a vibrant master of ceremony in a political event that was attended by the court leader. Just on Monday and yesterday, Tuesday, he was actively involved in his senatorial duties. He recounted his impressions of the late leader who dominated South Nyanza politics for almost two decades. He is a man who was exposed to high places but still lived a humble life. As a minister in the former government, he was still very down to earth. He did not accumulate wealth. He, did not. he would give you his last cent if you needed it. That's the kind of person he was. We uh, feel truly blessed to have had him in our lives. At the same time, Kajuang's father, David Ajuang, who has been ailing from diabetes, suffered shock on receiving the news from Moses, forcing the family to rush him to Kisumu for treatment. Um, he was brought in with, by relatives with complaints of um, dizziness and uh, um, shortness of breath. Um, and uh, he's been seen by the physician. He's currently undergoing some investigations. He's been admitted to the wards. Uh, he's in stable condition. I've seen him and uh, we've had a chat. Back in the streets of Homer Bay, some eulogized, others reminisced. But all of them were sad at the loss. We must say that as a, as a county, we've lost a farm guy, a strong person, a strong leader who would stand by his word. And uh, for everyone who, who has been in this country, is known for the slogan Bado Mapambano. Eh, alikuwa mtu mkarimu, shuja, kwa kika, sisi kama watu wa Homer Bay, tumepoteza shuja. The senator's demise comes at a particularly tough time for his party ODM and the opposition court coalition that are readjusting themselves to a new political landscape. Famed for his aggressive and humorous style of politics, the choir master is no more. And besides the loss to his family and Homer Bay County, the court fraternity as well as the country at large will miss Gerald Otieno Kajuang. Fredo Mulo, KTN, Homer Bay County.